Hi friends, welcome, welcome, welcome back to the Black Positivity Challenge. In case you guys are new here, this is where we come to get a break from all of the toxicity and negativity that is being spread on these internet streets. This is where you come to be reminded that there's beautiful people in the world, that there's beautiful things going on, that you can manifest beauty. And uh, we're going to talk about love today. What else should we be talking about today? Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful couple. Um, yeah, and I just want to share their love with you. Now, y'all know I love me some music. Y'all know I love me some music, right? So that video, I'm not even going to call it a video. That moment was so, 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 so beautiful and so dope to me. And talking about love, right? We think that we're going to be young forever. We're not going to need anyone. You know, we're going to be able to be on these dating apps and social media and replace people. But we are all going to get old one day and um you know it's just the importance of being good to people being kind to people and also the importance of relationships and i'm not saying that everyone should be in a relationship or having someone else is the end all be all it's not happiness is from within happiness is making sure that you're aligned spiritually um you know that you're fulfilling your goals and doing what you you know what you came here to do but there is something so beautiful about aging with someone and realizing that wow this person is still here for me and um we all know the isley brothers and ron isley right we all know the classics we all know the hits and just you know look at ron isley like he's older now 
you know, he's he has a full silver beard and um, to be able to see his wife now, you know, also being his backup singer, her and her sisters, it's just beautiful to see her carrying his voice and carrying his music for him as he is getting, uh, you know, older and not as agile and not uh, still have the ability to rock a crowd and perform the way he used to. And just to see that family moment and to see people aging together and to see, most importantly, that they are still having fun together. And once again, I talk about body language a lot. You can just see like, you know, for her to just love her husband in that way and for him to, <laughs> you know, just be taking it in. You can see that he doesn't have as much energy and vibrance as he used to, but you can see that his heart is smiling. So I definitely wanted to share that uh, moment because it's just, it's beautiful. And um, in the Isley Brothers, classic music. So, and them girls, they sang Baby Dump Johnson sisters, they sang that song and the <laughs> and the rapping and in the hip hop part of it. And it's it's just fun. And I just hope that this made somebody laugh today. And I hope it reminds you to go listen to some Isley Brothers because I will sure be doing so. <laughs> Can we talk for a minute? Girl, I want to know your name. So I tried to sleep on the floor while I was on my period. Then my BF did this. What are you doing? What are you doing? I'm sleeping on the floor. Why? Huh? It's so much better for you here. I know, babe. It's just that, like, you know. There's not enough space? No, 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 no. Here, you can no. switch. No, 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 babe. Switch. It's, a, you know what I mean? Oh. It's that time of the month? Yeah. It's okay, babe. What are, what are you doing? I'm coming with you, babe. Why? Babe, if you sleep on the floor, I, I come on the floor too. Me? Don't worry, babe. It's mm. kind of comfortable down here. <laughs> here, this is my blanket. You sure? Yes. <laughs> okay, now this young couple is... Come on, tell me this is not cute. Ladies, there are still sweet guys out there. There are kind men. <laughs> out there and the fact that he was like baby if you sleep on the floor I'm sleeping on the floor that is just so cute I mean it's puppy love you know we love puppy love we've all been there however there's still really kind men out here you know so for us women let's start loving and loving on and being open to the nerds and being open to the not so popular guys let's be open to the quiet guy that may be the kindest man and the most attentive man that you ever meet. And anyone that knows me knows that I love kindness. Like, oh my God, I love kindness. And I love, love, love a kind man because we know men are supposed to be strong and uh, they're supposed to be hyper-masculine. But, you know, when you see a man just being kind, that, you know, that always touches my heart. And like I said, I do want to give men their flowers and I do want to give encouragement because I think encouragement uh, lets people know what they're doing right and it encourages people to continue to do it. So I think, you know, one of my jobs is to let men know what they are doing right so that they can continue doing it. Let men know that we like good guys. We like nice guys. We like, you know, the nerdy guys. We like the corny guys. As long as you're kind, um, and you're loving and you're attentive, you know, I'll say we, you know, I'm married, but we women, you know, we, we love that. And um, yeah, and we're open to it. So I hope you guys enjoyed that little puppy love <laughs> video. And I hope you're having a good day. How are you guys? Yeah.